What's going on guys? This one will probably be relatively quick. I uh, just wanted to show you the latest addition to the CNC router that I just put together, uh, which is just a little simple keyboard and monitor stand for my router's computer. Uh, I wanted to get it up off the bottom shelf there to a little bit more comfortable and usable height. So uh, I had some old CRT television wall mount stands uh, laying in my basement. Uh, really not sure why I ever kept them. Uh, you know, I know I was never going to mount another CRT television to the wall. <laughs> but uh, I guess I have a hard time throwing away uh, steel and bracketry. So I kept them, and I guess maybe it was worth it as I put this together out of the pieces. But, uh, yeah, truth be told, I should have probably thrown those away. But uh, I got a couple little uh, mounts here, uh, you know, comprising the different pieces. Uh, you can see the hinge or the wall mount mounted to the machine there. And uh, that allows me to pivot the monitor out, uh, as well as the little keyboard stand, uh, which is made with another uh, wall mount arm. So uh, I could pivot that out from the machine. You know, I could sit down at my chair there. It's a nice, good working height uh, to look at the computer and use the keyboard. And uh, then again, if I want to just pivot it back out of the way, you know, it easily goes back into place there. And uh, also, if I want to pivot it out and work from a standing position, I can pivot the monitor backwards, uh, actually almost horizontal, and uh, just be a little bit more comfortable there uh, at my viewing angle and, uh, you know, see what's going on on screen as the machine's working. Now, uh, ultimately, I probably should get some kind of dust protection uh, to at the very least put on the back, but probably something that I can flip over to the front as well uh, when the computer is not in use. Uh, that'll be a later project, uh, but for now, I really like how this turned out. And, uh, you know, I think it should serve pretty well uh, for just something I kind of threw together last minute here. Now, I probably do need to paint everything. Uh, I'll probably do that later. Uh, I think I need some more paint and primer anyhow. But uh, I figured I'd show you the bracketry. Uh, just real simple. I had some scrap angle iron laying around uh, that I just drilled out for the pivot here. Uh, that's a little piece of one inch square tube with a couple pivots uh, to kind of increase my range of motion there. Uh, and then a couple pieces of angle on either side of that uh, that mount directly into these uh, VESA or VESA uh, mounting holes. Uh, these happen to be about 100 millimeters apart, uh, 100 millimeter bolt hole pattern. So that was pretty easy uh, to figure out and put together. And uh, then I've got just a pin here, kind of holding that in place there. Uh, hopefully this plastic doesn't wear out too quickly. I guess if it does, I can turn some metal or brass replacements on the lathe. Uh, you know, I probably won't be wearing it out too much as far as pivoting this out left and right. But we'll see how it holds up. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. I uh, just figured I'd show you that little project. And uh, pretty happy with how that turned out. So thanks for watching, guys. Any comments, questions, leave them below. We'll see you on the next one.